Hi guys, it's Trisha. Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I am back with another haul. I haven't done one of these since my last $2,000 haul something, which was back in like December. So we're doing another one. I believe this one is also almost $2,000. So this wasn't all bought at one time, it was like collective. And these things came from the US. It took a while for me to film this video because I had to wait for them to come. If you're new, please make sure to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up and let's get this video started. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with vans because i just got one thing these platform old school vans they're literally just the regular old school vans but these ones have a platform on them so they make it a little bit taller i have these in the checkerboard one and i just wanted them in the regular one these are like 65 they're a little bit more expensive than regular ones just because they're a platform brandy so i got nine things from there i don't have everything the first top i got is really colorful i wouldn't normally get this but this was only 21 bucks striped red tan and black long sleeve top i wouldn't normally buy this but i decided to go out of my comfort zone wow then i got this top these are i think they're called the charlise top charlene top but i could be wrong 18 bucks i got it in this blue color i have this in black white and green in the long sleeve and the short sleeve so I decided to get blue i was also gonna get pink but i don't think i would ever wear that it's a low cut v and then it scrunches up here it's really flattering i wear these all the time then i got this skirt i've really been wanting a brandy skirt and they have literally so many colors so i had such a hard time picking one so many colors in it so you can match this with anything and it has these little like slits on the side i'm gonna get this in more colors when i go back home next month then i got this black bralette i'm obviously not gonna try this on because it's see-through my last black bralette which is from victoria's secret pink is like falling apart so so I got this one plain lace one and I believe these are just like 11 bucks. They're really affordable Then the rest of these are black graphic This one is just a black really oversized shirt that says born in the usa I normally cut my clothes or I buy shirts that are like already cut This one I think i'm gonna keep like this and then just tie it or wear it with a skirt I can just tuck it into jeans or whatever then I got this top It was 20 dollars still has a tag on it because I haven't worn it This shirt was really in like Last summer and i'm just now getting it the yellow lightning bolt los angeles top they have this in tank tops and long sleeves and sweaters and t-shirts crop t-shirts so i decided to get the crop t-shirt one like this one this is also from brandy except i cut this myself gonna be honest don't know what all of this is is that what you're gonna say because the guy in the middle looks like this something. looks like the guy from marley and me so we got this top here it's like a little bit loose fitting but it's cropped which is how i like my shirt let me know who this is also this guy literally looks like owen wilson from marley and me but i'm really excited to wear these i've been wearing all of these this is the last t-shirt i got it says grand tour sport japan i've worn this a hundred times already i think i'm gonna cut it not sure yet i think it looked really cute cut like that okay see so on the graphic is just really cute i really want to get this in yellow that's all i got at brandy i also got a pair of star earrings my third pair of star earrings because i lost my other two pairs and i literally can't find the pair that i just bought i've bought the same earrings. i'm gonna do unif because i just got one thing this skirt that's everywhere and i have been wearing this non-stop because it's so cute plaid tablecloth material literally it's tablecloth material that says unif on it and this skirt would probably be like twenty dollars but because of this teeny tiny patch i paid like five times the amount could have sized up in this it's a little bit tight this is an extra small which is always 22 to 24 and i'm like not a 22 and i just like the color of it because it's red and orange and green i'm really happy about this it is really hyped about but i think their clothing is pretty cool glasses again i featured these in my outfits of the week video i'm just gonna show you guys them really quick again these are from glassesusa.com they have a ton of glasses if you guys didn't know i do wear glasses i have like cute little circle ones clear ones here burnt pink orange black pair with like the gold i also have these ones here and lastly i have these are ray-bans these are the ray-ban club masters they look like this i literally have two of these but the difference with these ones is they have prescription on them which is awesome because when you wear sunglasses then obviously you can't wear your regular glasses too duh so when you wear your sunglasses then you can't see but these sunglasses have prescription in them oh i can wear my sunglasses and still see so i'll have these linked below in case you guys want to check them out i think they're super super awesome so i'm gonna do hookah swim next i got two sets from them similar sets just different color different material so this first set is this blue 
and white mesh set. I believe these are $70. You guys will see them in the try on. It crosses in the back. Got this in an extra small. I kind of went up a size because the material of these like aren't that stretchy. They're neoprene. Is that what it's called? Neoprene. So they don't really stretch. The bottoms just match. They're like a V kind of bottom. Really pretty blue and the white mesh on the side. Then this set is velvet red. I'm really excited because I've never had a velvet bathing suit like this. This bathing suit top just looks like this. Again, it's a triangle one and in the back it crosses like an X. So these bottoms, again, they're like the V cut ones. I just today found out that these are like supposed to sit on your hips. I've been wearing them like this. They have like the trimming here around the edges. Super high quality, even though these are like 70, 80 bucks each. I think they're worth it because they're just, so these next two things I got, just kind of little random things. I don't remember where I got these. So I got this yellow beanie because I'm gonna wear it in the summertime and it's just a cute little mustard yellow color. Next thing I bought are these sunglasses. I don't remember where these are from. I probably will rarely wear them but they just look like from forever 21 i ordered quite a few things these are all tops then these are bathing suits so i got all a bunch of clothes for summer i'm gonna go through this kind of fast because i'm gonna go to class after this i'm running out of time so i got this red tank top here it's just a cute little rib this did look different in the picture but like it's fine and it's cropped it's itsy bitsy just like that this white tank top a youtuber named maggie mcdonald i saw her talk about these in a video and i thought i just wanted to grab one just plain white and then the bottom half is a ribbed material if you can see i have a ton of white tank tops now i have more white tank tops all of them are slightly different this next tank top also looked different than on the site but it's fine this is like a nude straight cut i thought this would be like a different material i guess but this is more of like an undershirt but i wouldn't like just wear this with jeans you know then i got this same tank top in two colors i have this in white i have this in black it's my favorite tank top these are 16 dollars at urban and at forever 21 they're eight dollars so they're literally half the price and they're the same exact thing how many ribbed tank tops do i need so i got yellow two straps instead of one and i also picked it up in green i really like this one actually i like the yellow one too but this color just i'm gonna get this in a bunch of other colors if they have any more colors also got this sports bra in that same exact color because i have to go to the gym more but i don't i used to go to the gym all the time but now i'm lazy so i figured maybe if i buy a cute sports bra i'll go to the gym that hasn't happened yet but the problem with this is i got it in a small instead of an extra small so it literally doesn't fit it's too big the back is really cute it's a razor back and then it has these little cutout things in it so the next thing is this pair of shorts i got these in a waist 24 and they're too big which doesn't make sense because the unit skirt is a 22 to 24 and it's too tight and this is a 24 and it's too big these are the ultra vintage shorts they're 22.90 i needed another pair of black denim shorts because my other ones were getting way too short on me i don't like these as much as my other ones my other shorts are from american eagle the only thing that bugs me is I don't know if you can tell, but the ripping kind of looks cheap on it. Like, it looks gray, and it doesn't look like legit ripping. Like, it just looks like they put it there. I'm super picky with how my shorts are. On this side and on this side is the exact same thing. So, it just, it looks kind of cheap to me, but I'll probably still wear them anyways. Then I got three bathing suits, and only one of them fit me, which is tragic, but I'll move on. This first one is just a plain black bathing suit. I have so many black bathing suits and I still bought another one. So this one just has a little keyhole in the center, ties up in the middle like that. I'll go up to school at 3.30, final answer. So I have a top really similar to this, I think, but I don't remember because now I have way too many black bathing suits. These two are actually colored. Both of these are too big. I ordered both of them in a small instead of an extra small and it doesn't fit. The top is 18 and the bottoms are 13, so $31. This top is like a copper bronze color. It's a band top like that one of the straps are really thin and then one of the straps are really thick cute concept it just doesn't fit me the bottoms are just plain bottoms they're the same exact color and this next set i was also really sad about because it was reversible and it doesn't fit me i believe again the top is 18 and the bottoms are 13 they kind of look like cones now that you look at it like that looks like a traffic cone but anyways back is open like this the bottoms are just plain the cheeky hip kind of ones these are reversible i think it has to be reversible because it only makes sense like that yeah it's reversible okay the other side if this really is the other side not sure but i think it is is nude like this 
I have so much to show. While we're still on bathing suits, I picked up a few from H&M. I love H&M bathing suits. They're just so affordable and they're really cute. I got these plain blue ones and then they tie at the sides and they have little ruffles on them. Super cute. Yeah, I really like these. I'll wear these with my 1000 plain black tops. And I also got another pair of bottoms to match with my black tops. This one is cheetah print. No, this one's leopard print, I think. They have ties on the side again, and then the little ruffles on the top. Then to go with those two bottoms, I got this plain black triangle top. And I actually really, really like this. It was super affordable. They're actually really good quality. So it's just a plain black triangle kind of top. In case I didn't want to wear this with one of these, I got another pair of plain black bottoms. I have maybe five pairs of plain black bottoms and they're all slightly different. A month or two ago, but I was waiting for all the other stuff to come before filming this haul. So it's kind of old news, but whatever. I bought another MacBook. This is expensive, but that's not what I was gonna say. This is the MacBook Air 13 inch space gray. And these things are expensive. $1,700, $1,800, too much money. But I needed a new MacBook because my old MacBook which I also bought. I just had it for a while, so I just need a new one. So I got this one, which I bought with my own money. It's already super duper dirty because I don't take care of my things and I don't have a case on it. Ow. Ow. I'm really excited because it has a ton of storage on it and I can use it for school and YouTube. I don't really take notes on my computer, but I'm going to start now. Because these don't have SD card ports or USB ports, I had to buy this. And I bought this one instead of the Apple brand one because it just has more ports on it this thing is four thousand pesos which is eighty dollars which is way too much money for this little thing because you already spend eighteen hundred dollars on this then you have to spend eighty dollars on this you just plug it in like that and then you can plug in your stuff in there i know you can get this on amazon for cheaper but i didn't so and lastly from the apple store i just got this little guy these things are what you put on your earphones to plug it into your phone because if i'm using my earphones on my laptop which is like this i can't use them on my phone after so i have to use this these things are literally 14 bucks i'm pretty sure you can buy this at any like electronic store but i still decided to buy it at apple we have made it to the end and i'm late for school top shop i got three things from there this first thing you guys have seen in my vlog from like a month ago so that just shows that i've had this stuff for a while i just haven't gone across filming this video until now actually time out i filmed this video earlier this week and i didn't like how it turned out so i'm filming it again now so i got this bathing suit top it's just like a floral print one and then it ties in the center you actually tie it yourself at first when i was wearing this i had it like this and i was like how the heck this is like squeezing my arms and it didn't make sense to me then i realized it's like off the shoulder like that which is cute i think this was probably like 15 bucks maybe and i got two dresses which i didn't need but i did it anyways so this first one is big on me and you get it altered it's just a velvet dress it's straight across and then it has these teeny tiny straps and it flows really long like maybe that's not long but for me i like my dresses to be like that so i have to get this altered this dress is probably like 30 35 bucks i don't know when i'm gonna wear it to or where i'm gonna wear it to then this last thing i've worn it twice already it's like an overall dress velvet like this one that is not a real pocket right and then it has little circle metal clasp things. And then the bottom is a cute little skirt with cute little pockets. I wore this like last week with a Calvin Klein bralette underneath and it was super duper cute. This was like the same price as this. I think these were both 35 But yeah, those are the last two things in my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to do this outro really quick because I have to go to school. Please make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe below if you haven't yet. And let me know what other kind of videos you guys want me to do. I'm also going back home next month. So let me know what videos you guys want me to do there. So I think that's pretty much it. So I will see you guys next week with another video. Peace out.